So, my rod have arrived and my fake lily pads. <laughs> They've come in as well. But nice big box again, jolly good. DC freshwater fish. Right, let's get this in the garden and get them unboxed in, in their tank. Right, so I thought I'd do it right by the tank. I think I've got everything I need. I'll just stick these fake uh, lily pads in because they'd be pretty freaked out and give them some hiding space straight away. Bit of a long job. Takes ages one of these tanks, obviously, because it's a lot of a lot of um, water to go in. Oh, wind's blowing them everywhere. Sod this, it take all day. Hold on. How much of this you can see? <laughs> Just trying to do it quick. The old goldfish like these because they, they go right underneath them. Use them as shelter and that. That's good. Right. Let's get this open. It's hard to do it when you're looking through the camera sometimes. <laughs> and outside you can't see them. Mate. Hopefully they'll be right. So in here I've got, like I said before in my other videos, I've got five, oh they've done separate, good. They've done five, um, three inch, two to three inch I think it was, rud, and five bigger ones, four to five inch, because they're, they're gonna be my breeding ones. Hopefully it's a mix of male and female. Oh yeah. Let's do the. Oh. You can do it. I will lie. They're the bigger ones. Let's get them in there. Three, four, five. They're all alive as well. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, they're all alive. I might float them in the water for now. Thing is, I'll be able to, yeah, I'll be able to reach the bag. <clears throat> Let's float them in there for the moment. While I sort the others out. Let's give it a box. So I'm just, um, took the temperature a minute ago. I have, I've had my hand on the thermometer. <laughs> it was just below 15 a minute ago, 13, 14. I see this is the water straight out of the tote. Um, so they have warmed up a little bit in the bag, I bet, in the box. Yeah, that's, that's gone back up now, but it was about 13, 14 a minute ago. So definitely worth just acclimatizing them a little bit. So I bet they warmed up a little bit in the, in the, in the actual cardboard box. I have to lip them somewhere around. Right, I'll sort these ones out first. So, I've cut the thing already. That was too hard last time trying to open it and film at the same time. Let's get these big ones in. Or the bigger ones. Come on. There's some a better sized ones, these are for, for the breeding. So I'll get these in one at a time, use them in net. 
And I'll give him a little check as well, just to make sure they're okay. Look, they look fine to me. I've got to learn that the the difference between male and female. Now straight away I've noticed that one is a lighter colour, I don't know if that's anything to do with it. I've got to do a bit of research about which is male and female. I did ask them to um, do a mix that makes sense for, for breeding. Um, but I'm still trying to find out how you tell the difference between the two. Right, let's do one at a time. Don't jump out too much. They're lovely colour red. It's looking alright. The new home. We want one. Looking nice. Yeah, nice. Yep, looking alright. Yep. Nice colour rod. I used to love going rod fishing. Very good fishing around May, June time, rod. Obviously now I find out it's because of the spawning. <laughs> Just one. <clears throat> Don't even know if he's uh, at the age of ready to breed or anything yet. <laughs> it's a long term project anyway, so. Can do it. One more, and then I'll do the littlins. Beautiful. I don't know how much as you can see. I'm trying to do two things at once, always hard. Nice sized ones there. Right, let's get the lippers in. Right, so once again I've cut the tops before I started filming, make your life a bit easier. My little dinky ones. Little dinkies. These might be part of the breeding program, or they might be just food. I haven't decided yet. All right, let's get let's get these in one at a time. Dinkies. It's hard to see. Right. Is he coming out? Yeah. yeah, he's in there. Oh, oh filming. Yep. Bigger than that one. There's one that's tiny. Can't remember which where I've got him already. Right.
two left. Would like to see the other side. Yeah, it looks right. They're all looking good. Oh. And the last one. Oh. Hey, he's good. Beautiful little fish. Come out. Yeah. Right. That's them in. And find them up to weed, that's good. Come down there. Right, I've got to get start getting set up now. Get the air pump on. Still the panel air pump going and fill the rest of this up as well. Here we go. My new rug breeding, breeding project. Like I say, it's long term really. Some of these little ones might be food, but we'll see.